Yo, Emma. Hi. All right, guys. Welcome to New Orleans. Wow. Thank you. How's the tour been going so far? Yeah. Good as shit. That's awesome. All right. Your third album, The Weeding, just came out this month. So how's it going? How's it selling? Well, we've been on tour for about two weeks now, and all the shows have been great. There hasn't been any shitty shows, so, so I feel like... Atlanta was a rager. Yeah, we had okay. a little... Tainsville was a rager. Was good. Yeah, a lot of cool warehouse shows. Yeah, that's The Weeding awesome. EP has been well received. That's very good. I usually ask that, but nobody wants to answer. Out on Tank Crimes Records. I'll answer it. Low price is like Alright. Well, tell them. Let me know when you hit the record yeah, button. You're already I'm recording, it. man. I'm not quitting my day job, so if you want to hire me on, mm -hmm. I'll be on. Alright, tell me more about the album. What's it about? Well, well it's, it's not a full oh, album, it's a, it's a teaser part. to the one that's coming up next. Oh. Yeah, it's a four song ripper, a four song maxi if you will. And uh, it's got two songs about um, how the buds are eventually coming here to like, you know, rip the earth and turn it into like a big, you know, demonic pop party. Uh, and, uh, two demonic pop party means funky pop party. Yeah, funky pop party. <laughs> and then two songs about uh, just, you know, anecdotes about people getting fucked up when they're smoking weed you know, evil shit like that. Have you all had any weird stories about smoking pot and something happened, scary? One time, I, this guy brought me this weed and then I uh, smoked it and he said, that ain't weed, that's crystal meth, homes. Mm -hmm. And then I woke up in Debo's chicken coop. <laughs> <laughs> Pigeon coop. Uh, yeah, get it right, uh, dude. Oh, no. That's because y'all smoke too much pot. You don't remember. Yeah, we got good weed stories, but we don't remember. Oh, okay. All right. The album costs in the CD form four dollars and twenty cents, right? Yeah. Is that any significant number for any reason, or did Pretty you? Pretty much. <laughs> highway four twenty is the first time we ever smoked weed. We're on that highway. Okay, so. that's cute. I smoked weed for the first time on this tour. It was weird. I've actually never smoked. No? Oh, man. I, I was just kidding about that. I, I, smoke if, if it comes at, at, okay, if it comes at the end of the night and we have a long drive the next day, we have to have the marijuana or we, and uh, so let that be to anybody that comes to the shows He's that really we need, the, we need that thing. <laughs> we need it. We need it. Yeah, last night was a scramble. We need it. We used to be a straight edge crew, but uh, our parents hated it, so we decided to smoke weed so that they'd like accept us more. Okay, my mom told me to smoke <laughs> weed instead of drink. Your I mom is kind of. I want to meet that mom. You do. She's <laughs> apparently really hot. And oh, you got a hot mom that smokes weed. That's what they say. Come to the show. Smoking good. We got a couple right. single guys in this band. How many are single? Raise your hand. Well, we can't give exact numbers right now. How about I do this instead of raising my hand? There you Zoom go. in right to this guy. Yeah, yeah. Just this guy. Yeah. He's the, I guess he's the singlest. Oh, oh I wasn't this expecting guy. company. Yeah. All right. He's the second guy. I got single. No, I've got... There's a name <laughs> he keeps looking that way, but there ain't nobody there. Yeah. That was where my pretend hoes are. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I really like the tour poster with Beavis and Butthead zombies in a post-apocalyptic world. Who came up with that? Because I, I like uh, Beavis and Butthead. I think somebody said, no, we grinded came up with the yeah. yeah, with the idea. Bantering with ramming speed. We just kind of came up with it. And then somebody was like, let's just have it be like undead. Hmm. We were we were chilling. We were smoking a big dude with Mike Judge, and uh, he was like, "Hey man, you guys should use Beavis and Butthead, dude." So nah, he doesn't know Mike Judge. He's yeah, just, yeah. Just he's don't tell Mike Judge I said that. You want to get sued? Fuck. Cease and desist. Yeah. <laughs> Please. What do you think Mike Judge is gonna do now that King of the Hill has been canceled? Oh, I didn't know it had been canceled. It's canceled. It's over. Damn. She makes we better movies. cancel the show. Yeah, we're canceling the show. <laughs> I love King here. of the Hill. Stop packing up the King shit. of the Hill was on our rider. Yeah. I'm sure we'll weep into his that. huge bags of money. Right. He's got money. Hmm. Let me make something else that's so fun. All right. Some of y'all are in other bands. How do you find time to make music and tour with this band? Whenever we can. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. This dude's pretty busy. 
Yeah. 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 Yeah